It seems nobody is immune. It's alleged that Angela Merkel has been the most recent victim of NSA spying. She's demanded an explanation from the US to claims that her mobile phone was tapped. Despite the gravity of the scandal, there hasn't yet been a comprehensive EU response. There was, however, a strong backlash in the European Parliament. A majority of MEPs voted for a resolution to suspend the EU's swift bank data exchange agreement with the US. It is an outrage that member states, governments have done nothing so far. They are turning a blind eye, which is unacceptable. The allegations that the United States National Security Agency has been massively hacking the privacy of the European citizens should be more than enough for all of them to tackle the issue together. But this resolution has been the subject of lively debate. Not all MEPs approved the proposed text, namely members of the EPP. If we are lifting this up, nobody is looking at the um, financial issues of terrorists. And this is for me a security question and um, this has nothing to do with all these what's uh, alleged in, in the newspaper um, regarding SWIFT because we don't have any proof at all um, that uh, the NSA is really spying on the SWIFT uh, data. Whistleblower and former CIA contractor Edward Snowden exposed this US spying. Since then, allegations have grown that the NSA has spied on the private data of many EU citizens. This MEP has called for changes to rules on personal data protection. We want to strengthen the individual rights, uh, especially transparency and right to information, right to access, and also the right to deletion. And uh, there we strengthen the idea behind the right to be forgotten. The issue of personal data protection will likely go to the negotiating table at the Council Summit on Friday. MEPs are calling for a firm response from EU heads of state and government.